Hey everyone, welcome back to Robo Request. You ask, we build. Now we bring your creative ideas to life with another exciting Arduino project. And this time we have built something super practical and fun. It's a digital current monitor with LED bar display using ECS712. Now this project came from request of Dylan's 77319 and if I see F who wanted a detailed tutorial for this project. Keep your ideas coming, your project could be next. Let's dive into it. Here what we will need for this project. One Arduino Uno, one ACS712 current sensor, 5 ampere version, 6 LEDs, 6 220 of resistors, one breadboard, a 5 volt DC motor, jumper wires, a USB cable for programming, two 3.7 volt rechargeable batteries with its holder, water regulated 5 to 6 volt supply. Let's start by setting up the hardware connection. Connect the current sensor in series with the motor. Connect battery holder positive terminal to sensor's IP positive. Connect sensor's IP negative terminal to motor's positive. Connect motor negative to battery holder's negative. No Arduino connections for the current sensor. Connect sensor's VCC to Arduino 5 volt pin. Connect sensor's GND to Arduino GND pin. Connect sensor out pin to Arduino's analog pin A0. Now take a breadboard. Connect the GND of the Arduino to the negative rail of the breadboard. Now place each LED in such a way that their shorter leg means the cathode is connected to the negative rail of the breadboard. Now connect the longer leg of each LED to digital pins from T2 to D7 through 220 ohm resistors like this. Each LED represents a current range step. Make sure to check all your connections again before uploading the code. Now download the code and library files given in the description below. Open the code file in the Arduino IDE. We begin by defining the pins and variables. Sensor pin reads the analog voltage from the ACS712 current sensor. LED pin 6 stores the digital pin connected to the 6 LEDs. Current will store the calculated current in amperes. In the setup function, we set all LED pins as outputs so they can light up. We start serial communication at 9600 baud to monitor current values on the serial monitor. The loop function runs continuously and does the following step. Read the sensor value. Arduino reads the voltage from ACS712 on analog pin A0. The value ranges from 0 to 1023. Convert sensor value to current. ACS712 outputs 2.5 volt at 0 ampere with 0.185 volt per ampere for a 5 ampere version. Formula converts the analog reading to current actual in amperes. Print current to serial monitor. This allows you to see real-time current readings while testing the motor. Control LEDs based on current. Each LED represents a 0.2 ampere step. For example, 0 to 0.2 ampere LED 1 on, 0.2 to 0.4 ampere LED 1 and 2 on, 0.6 to 0.4 to 0.6 ampere LED 1, 2, 3 on and so on. Small delay for stability. Adds a 100 millisecond delay to avoid flickering and stabilize readings. And that's it. Once uploaded, power the Arduino using cable only. Turn the motor on, or in case load, you will see the LEDs light up progressively. This gives a visual current bar displaying, showing how much current the motor is drawing in real time. Students can use this project in science exhibitions to visually demonstrate how current changes with motor load. It also perfect for robotic competition to monitor motor performance and prevent overload. I hope you found this project helpful and inspiring. Thanks for watching and don't forget to like, comment and subscribe for more creative Arduino builds. This is Robo Request. You ask we build. See you in the next one. Robo Army. One-stop global community for teens in robotics and AI.